Welcome back, folks, to the Organ Trail Director's Cut. When last we left off in our endless mode, Sub-Zero and his band of survivors had travelled nearly 7,000 miles. Let's move on. For some reason into a driving area. What's going on here? Oh, oh, it's repeating this. It's repeating just crushing zombies. Well, we can do that. Let's repeat crushing zombies. We could do that. As you could, um... Imagine, this is probably the best piece of news we're going to get in this video, because, uh, the supply situation is very tight indeed. There are things about Endless Mode that I didn't actually know until going into it, namely the fact that, uh, as you go on, supplies get really scarce. And now we're getting to the point where it's going to be really, really difficult to get anything. However, we did get a, uh, 105 people there. Welcome to Morlopolis! There are no jobs here anymore. The car is in a bad way. The party is in a bad way. And we have no medkits left. We have a fair amount of, uh, food, but no fuel. There's a lot we can buy here, but we don't have the money for it. So what we're going to have to do right now is we're going to have to scavenge while the going is still good. And hope that we get some things that we can start trading away. Mainly we need to, uh, get a lot of things, but it's most just going to be food, I think. I don't think there's, any, there's much more that we actually get now when we scavenge. Like, we only scavenged here, we got one item, and that was pretty much it. So now things are going to start getting really difficult. Just gotta avoid all these zombies. Like, one thing of food, that's all we got. We need to shoot that one. One thing of food I can deal with, that's, um, it's something. It's not much, though. We got a hundred ounces of food while scavenging. Like, that is all we got. We actually need to keep scavenging right now. All we're gonna get is food. A hundred ounces of food per hour scavenged from what I can see. Oh, hello. You are gonna get shot. There aren't many that I do shoot, but that one we will. Ooh! Here's something else. We'll have that. You should back away, sir. So no, it would seem as we haven't got to that point just yet. But we will get to that point. And... Oh no! <laughs> I forgot that I'm not as fast as I would like to be. So we will, uh, shoot that- oh! Oh no! We got stuck there. I shouldn't have backed away. Party's not doing very well. We do need to keep scavenging. We do need to keep trying. We need more food, we need more money. We also need to shoot that zombie. And while we're at it, we're gonna shoot this one too. And this one! Because we need this food. We need anything that we can get. Absolutely anything. We got two things in that, uh, scavenging there. We are faster than most of the zombies, but we're not faster than all of them. And I think our luck might have run out! Nope, nope, not yet. Not yet! We're gonna keep scavenging for as long as we can. Long as we can. 15 ounces of food, that's fine. We're gonna scavenge some more. Money. That's something we need. We need to buy more, we need to buy a lot more fuel. We need to buy a lot more fuel. And we're gonna see if we can just outrun these. Ooh, that's food, that, that's food that they're all gonna try and get. They're both gonna try and get it. Only one of them got it though. And now he's stuck. Now he is stuck. He literally is stuck. It's a shame I, uh, can't get access to that food myself. But I'm too busy running away from these zombies. We did find $20, though. One more scavenge. And then we just gotta make do with whatever situation we've got. This is high activity of zombies. This is a bad time to scavenge. But we need whatever we can get. We need 
whatever we can get. Like that food there. We need that food. We need that food. Hello, zombies! I, I only wanted that food. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna go this way now. And avoid all of you. There we go. Excellent! We didn't get much food there. 35 ounces of food. Party is not in a good way at all. We could probably still rest here. I'm gonna keep scavenging, because it's getting really bad. I know this is reducing our total score, but at this point, we need to see if we can go just one more little tiny bit. We don't want to end up stranded on the side of the road. We need more fuel. Fuel is the thing we primarily need now. That's a lot of zombies. This should definitely be the last time we scavenge. This should definitely be the last time we scavenge, because look at all these zombies. Oh, and that one managed to catch me. Okay, that's enough. Oh yes, that is enough. Uh, we need to do a fair few things. First, we need to do some... Uh, is there anybody who wants to trade? No. No, there is not. We need to rest. We need to rest really badly. Five hours? We need to rest a little. We just need to get the party in a good enough shape that we can start thinking about things like repairing the car and everything else. Okay. Alright. The car is in a terrible way and we need to fix it. We have enough scrap to fix it. This could very well be the last leg of our journey though. Could very well be the last leg. Well, that's a pretty decent fix. I'm in a very bad way. Sub-Zero is uh, not doing very well. We need to hope that we can just find something amazing on the road. Not, do not doing too badly the repair jobs, though. I think we'll only need one more. We don't have much food, either. We just don't have much of anything. We might want to, re want to see if we can trade for just a few hours. And that was pretty good! Grade A on fully fixed up car. Marvelous. Alright. Let's see if we can trade just a few hours. You want one scrap for one of their batteries. Yeah. Seems good. Two more hours of waiting. No one and one more. 20 of their food for 12 of your ammo. No. Alright. What have we got? We need to buy some fuel. We need more fuel than that. We need to sell stuff. We need to sell... S Ooh. We could sell food for quite a bit, actually. I'm gonna sell 200 food for $60. That's a risk. But we can always get more food. Oh, they only have two cans. We do need a medkit, though. But we do need this money. We only have two cans? Oh dear. Um, we'll wait a few more hours on the trading, then. Ten of their dollars for two of your- No! That is an awful deal! Four of their scrap for one of your- Don't have it. Alright, we're gonna just gonna have to do some more scavenging. We need a little more food before we're going to he head out. There is some food. It's getting dangerous. There is a zombie we really want to kill. There we go. Excellent. Ooh, and there's more food. That's quite useful. Very useful. Let's go get it. Good haul for food all round, I think, here. Yeah. Let's not get hit by any of these zombies. We're in a sort of fuel situation here. We just don't have enough fuel. We're just going to have to hope that we can get some on the road. Well, 200 ounces of food while scavenging has pretty much made up for the uh, deficit on uh, food there. A few more, though. 
This is, looks pretty good. There's a part of me that says we need to scavenge, 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 but there's another part that says we just need to get enough to get on the road and then move out again. Because it's all about the score in Endless Mode. Just leading these in a little circle. Nothing else seems to have spawned this time. But I'll take a hundred ounces worth of food. We do need to do some resting anyway. Oh, careful. Just, uh, thread through there. Excellent. Success! Aha! Excellent. We're going to do some resting. And then against my better judgment, we're going to head out. We need to. A few more hours. Three more hours. Oh, Sub-Zero is in a poor way. I know we're resting through the time that we could be spending, uh... Doing, uh... Scavenging. But we need to head out. We need to head out, unfortunately. We have enough food and a fair bit of scrap. It's just the fuel situation. Hopefully! We'll find somewhere along the way that'll get, uh, get fuel for us. Oh, uh, wow, well, these are miles away. Um... Himalayan city. We're gonna have to go there and hope that the fact that it's a city means there'll be fuel. Ooh. Sub-Zero is in a bad way. A really bad way. We are not doing well. This could very well be the last part of our journey. We have two cans of fuel and 561 miles. Wild fruit, though. Nice score, though, I think. I don't know if it's good, though. We are almost out of fuel. If we had the solar panels, we could move very, very slowly. We lost the tire there, by the way. I clicked a bit too fast. Lost the tire. Fortunately, we have spare tires. Oh, don't make really annoying noises. And don't tell us about that time you went to the center of the Earth. No one believes that. We are almost out of fuel. Bert has measles. Bert! Now is not the time. Bert! Really? We're out of fuel. We are out of fuel. We need to trade. Okay. Is there anyone that wants to trade with us? We're just gonna have to wait and hope somebody can provide us with fuel. One of the. Yeah, why not? I really need fuel. One of their battery for 11 of your. Uh, yeah, why not? We just keep trading away and getting back batteries. We need to wait. We need to wait so that we can hope we get fuel. Has slowly we deteriorating. For their fuel for two I don't have med kits. Twenty-five of their ammo for eighty-one of your food. Nope. Three of their fuel for yes. We have fuel again. And you know what? We're going to scab it. Your health is critical. Risk your life and venture out? Yes. I have to. I have to risk my life. It's just what I must do. My health is indeed critical, but it's uh, not going to get better. We need that food. We need that food really badly. Basically, that's the game warning us. Hey, you could die if you do this. You could die. I have to risk it, though. I have to risk it. I've got no way to actually restore my health. I've got no med kits. But hey, this is a pretty good haul. Just gotta be very, very careful. We need more food. We need more fuel. Nice! Five dollars. Yep. Our health is indeed critical. Ooh, more bullets. Very nice. No. Sorry. That shot had to be accurate. We need that food. We need this food, too. We need a lot of food. 
Let's grab this while we can. I think we have enough food that we can actually head out to the next town. I think we have enough. We certainly have enough fuel. If we're going to have enough fuel to get to the town afterwards is another question. But, 200 ounces of food. We have a lot of food. How's our health? It's good. It's going to have to be good. Three cans should get us the remaining 200 miles to town. Hopefully. Oh, really, Copper? Really? How did you ruin it with that? How did you ruin it? Well, we ruined a muffler as well, but we're going to get to the city. And that's the important thing here. Was bitten while trying to st Oh, Copper! No, now two people are infected. Welcome to Himalayan City. What jobs are there? $32 and fixing up the car. Let's fix up the car first and then do the $32. Hopefully we can buy fuel here. The dollars will be nice either way. I'm sure we can buy something with them. I'm sure we can buy something. Sub-Zero refuses to give in that easily to the zombie threat. He'll fight to the last to survive. And hopefully we'll survive for a little while longer. I mean, we nearly traveled 700 miles to get to Himalayan City here. Nearly traveled 700 miles. We are not going to get 90 this time, are we? Oh, we might. Nope. Just shy of 90. How is the car? Car's looking okay. Alright. Jobs. $32. $32. Head right. We can head right. And avoid all these zombies. Alright. Careful, Sub-Zero. You are in a very bad way. We cannot afford you to get hit. You will die if you get hit. Uh oh. Oh! Here lies Sub-Zero. Do you wish to write an epitaph? Yes. Don't turn around. Alas. Here lies Sub-Zero. And with the death of Sub-Zero... One thousand nine hundred score. Not terrible, I hope, anyway. We got somewhere. It was going to end at some point. It was going to end at some point. And unfortunately, it ended with a horrible, horrible death. But that's not all for the Organ Trail. For there is one more thing that we can do. And that is to once more step out on the trail but be far more reckless in the route that we take. Head out, go through the radiation field, see how quickly we can get to the safe haven. By taking shortcuts that will be more perilous, but on the other hand will also provide us with more lucrative rewards for being perilous. Who knows? Maybe we might actually get there faster. Maybe we might actually defeat the boss that's there. Maybe we might lose everyone and our poor, poor team will be stuck with just the person driving the car and everybody else horribly dead. That sometimes is just how your luck goes in the organ trail. So, I'll catch you next time, folks. And I'll see you then. Later.